Did you know they had upgraded technology for toilet brushes for all things? This is the old bristle style that I feel has been around since my childhood. They've updated that a little bit through the years with that tiny little lip that goes underneath the lid of the toilet. And this is the new style. This is a silicone style, much nearer in approach, much more flexible and not designed to trap. You can see if you look closely, there's a bunch of hair and gunk trapped in this one. The advantages of this are supposed to be that it dries much faster, that it doesn't trap water when you're pulling it out of the toilet. This style, I know definitely, there's like waterfalls falling off of it, and this one doesn't. It takes up much less room and storage, and there's a little bit more advanced technology. So if you look at this storage container, you can see the breathability. Let's see if I can get a good angle there. The breathability in it, and it sits inside this case with the ventilation holes in the bottom, just helping it be more sanitary. So what I thought I would do is clean in four ways. We would clean with just the bristle bus and the silicone on the back, no cleaner. And then we would add cleaner to the front comparing them and we'd get a good idea. Did I clean the same? Is it any improvement? A couple of things I did notice. These did do a little bit more of the power work for me, I think because there's infinitely more bristles. I did have to scrub a little bit more force with this one. I really liked how the tip of this kind of scooped up under this lip better. I found that over time, this little, I don't know, it is jet out. It's just not getting the job done. Um, and that this was much more effective of getting up underneath. It found stuff that I hadn't found before. So that was good and gross. <laughs> I do find that this one maintains a lot more water when I pull it up. This one holds a lot less, so I feel like there's just a lot less of the drainage and drippage and storage, so I would choose this one. The edges of the bowl cleans the same with the lip under the bowl. I like this one better. With the base of the bowl and the hole, they were about the same. I do feel like this one is going to dry faster and more effective just because it doesn't hold so much water. I do like that this one is so much more compact. It is so easy to just kind of tuck it away and hide it and you don't even know it's there. Whereas this is a lot chunkier and I, I can't do that same thing. It's just, the base is too big. Overall for the investment, I think this is great. They're both very inexpensive. They both got the job done. I think this one long-term may be a little bit more sanitary. Hope that helps you in making a purchasing decision.